so they only can drink the water when there's a rain cloud in the sky pouring water. So in, that's probably why we don't see too many of those birds in Vrindavan, because <laughs> there's not too many rain clouds around here. <laughs> so so the, they're very anxious, because of the shortage and the rarity of getting any water or seeing any rain clouds, they're very anxious and eager to see one, because if they don't drink, they will die. So they're crying anxiously, chatakis anxiously cry out loud for the rain. In other words, if I don't if I don't get this if I don't get this water, rainwater, I will die. So Sneya Nam, chanting Sneya Nam means the Acharya is telling us like a chatiki, we should think that if I if I don't get the taste of this name, if I don't get Nam Ruchi, if I don't experience the taste of this name, like the taste of the rainwater, rainwater has rust. Ras means liquid, means water, it means taste. Rasvaham apsakonteya prabhasmi shashi suriyo. Krishna says, I am the taste in water. So the chattiki bird is flying for the ras, eagerly, anxiously looking and begging and waiting when, when. So, so sneya na means we should chat like that. Part of sneya na is to be anxious to experience sneya na. In other words, be anxious, be eager and anxious just like the chattiki, to taste the ras of rain which gives them life, we should be anxious and eager to take, taste the nam ras which gives life to devotion, gives life to bhakti. Because you're just chanting and it's all the time sawdust name, you know, 